Alright guys, today we're looking at a new rogue called PC Defender Plus. Unfortunately, it doesn't run correctly in my virtual machine, so we're forced to look at it like this again. Hopefully the quality will be a lot better since we're using a new camera. So, let's get started. So anyway, when you first boot up your computer, you get this PC Defender Plus bullshit. I don't think it's a clone of anything, but, well, maybe it is. It definitely has new graphics. Looks all nice and new and different than what we've seen lately. It doesn't automatically scan, which is a little strange. You got a quick start scan to get it to do anything. And it finds all these infections, and it tells me 77 critical objects were found, and asks me to either register or remind me later. We'll go ahead and do that. Leave unprotected. Got a pop up over here saying that Trojan Clicker JS has been detected or some shit like that. So I guess this is sort of like that live security platinum or whatever. Maybe they just got new, new graphics for it. Try to flip the switch, it'll turn on for a second and then it'll tell you to activate. Personal security, proactive defense, firewall configuration. Try to check something. Purchase later. And it does do that redirection of .exes, which is annoying because you can't run anything directly. So, let's see. Nope. No task manager. Obviously no solitaire. Let's try to activate. See if we can get the site up. Alright, so there it is. $78.45. Sort of an arbitrary price, really. Anyway. Go ahead and close it. And uh, let's go ahead and take a shot at removing this. This one sort of makes a rookie mistake, honestly. But check this out. Alright, so first thing you do is boot into safe mode. Let's go ahead and do that. Go ahead and do safe mode with command prompt. Alright, so the first thing you want to run is regedit. Let's go to H key classes root dot exe. Come on now. Man, I'm bad at this. Dot exe. Expand it. Go to shell. Let's see, I think this is it. Yeah, just go ahead and clear out this open key. Go ahead and go to, go back to your command prompt, open msconfig, startup, and very conveniently, it's right there. Rookie, mistake, you never see that. I haven't seen that in forever. They were able to just fire up msconfig, 
and stop it from running. Lazy as shit. Alright. And then from here you can just go ahead and reboot. And boot back into regular mode. Alright, then from here you can just go ahead and fire up. Oh shit, maybe not. Looks like you can. Alright, we're good. Go ahead and fire up Internet Explorer. Go ahead and download. Eventually. Combo fix. And it sort of jacks with your file types. Like it's saying type 4G. I don't even know what that is. So I guess just ignore that. Save it. Go ahead and run it. Agree. The hell? Well, anyway, you'll get the nice command prompt window. It's gonna go ahead and set itself up to run. There might be other prompts, but it'll all take care of itself. So now it's in the scanning stage. Should take about 10 minutes. And we will be back. Alright, so it's 50 stages of scanning has completed. It's in the process of deleting files right now. Should be wrapping up shortly. Preparing log report. Now it's in its final stage of producing a log. And there it is, your combo fix log. It's all very interesting. Just go ahead and close it. And that'll wrap it up for PC Defender Plus. Come check us out at malwareup.org. Thank you for watching.